We're happy that uh, they've committed an immediate seven and a half million dollars, um, only their second day in uh, in office, and uh, to make that commitment is is great, uh, and we're looking forward to them fulfilling the commitment at budget time for their for the remainder of the of their promise. So. And is the dollar figure that's been restored by the provincial government enough? Well, no, in, uh, but immediately it's going to help divisions uh, in a short term and then uh, with more funding uh, foreshadowed then we'll be able to, uh, you know, I'm sure it'll go a long way to supporting classrooms um, in April when, uh, when that comes through. So, uh, so yeah, it's a great start and, and we're very pleased. And does this restore the STS faith in the provincial government's commitment to education? I think so. It, it does uh, signal a, a new relationship. I mean, uh, this this amount is, uh, while, it, while it seems small, is, it goes a, a long way to um, signaling a new relationship and, uh, and uh, recognizing their commitment to, uh, um, to even more funds um, in the March or April budget. Um, but so yeah, it signals a new relationship and, uh, and we're quite excited. And what would the STF's message to the public be about the restoration of funding? Well, there's a lot of um, support that's required to restore the, um, the classroom experience for students. But uh, that said, this will, uh, this will be a great start and we know that divisions will have lots of uh, different plans for spending it and, uh, and ways to spend it to support students. And so I'm sure they look forward to getting to work on that and, and then, as I say, awaiting the, uh, the budget uh, in the near future as well.